If you're still reeling over the Equifax breach and looking for some solace, I might have just the ticket for your winter reading list. I'm Scott Schober, and this is your two-minute cybersecurity briefing. If you're one of the 145 million Americans put at risk from the Equifax breach or just concerned about your digital identity, Swiped by Adam Levin could not come at a better time. Levin's 30 plus years of experience with consumer fraud and identity theft adeptly shades his conversation with readers. As the founder of Identity Theft 911, Levin has seen his share of fraud horror stories and is more than happy to share them. Levin flat out admits to his readers, you're going to get got, so you might as well assume the worst and learn how to protect yourself. But this once hollow threat from virus scanning software makers in the 90s is no longer just a cheap scare tactic. Every single person you and I know has had some personal information compromised in some way. They may not even yet seen the effects, but that doesn't mean it's not already out there in the dark web or on some hacker's PC. Any expert will tell you that there is just no such thing as 100% security, but that doesn't mean we give up either. By educating and arming ourselves with basic security practices, we could send hackers away to more vulnerable targets 99% of the time. That's still going to leave that last 1% open to the most determined attackers. But isn't it better to truly secure 99% of your attack vectors than, rather than living with the full sense of 100% security? In his glossary, Levin outlines scams, including the car ad wrap scam. This scam is a variant on much older ones, but it's become popularized through get-rich-quick email offers and spam. The victim receives an email promising $1,500 check in exchange for driving their car with an ad wrapped around it for the world to see. Once they agree, they're FedEx to check in excess of the $1,500. They're told to cash the entire check and simply wire the excess amount for another party who needs it for additional ad artwork fees. Of course, a few days after the victim does this, they're told by their bank that the original check was no good. This leaves the scammers with a few hundred dollars of the victim's real money and the victim left holding a bounced check. Parts one and two of the book are great beginner's resource for basic cybersecurity precautions. As they relate to things like identity theft, and fraud. In part two, Levin gets into the mind of the identity thief in an effort to profile motives and means. This approach helps readers not only see the invisible threat, but also helps them step through a minefield of potential missteps by seeing where the hackers like to place those hidden mines. I do wish the author spent more time on things like credit freezes in light of major breaches of Equifax or even Uber. Sometimes, the most affordable and basic steps like changing passwords or even freezing your credit can protect data the most effectively. All of our personal information is out there, so an excellent overview like Swiped is always a welcomed addition to any library. I give Swiped four and a half stars out of five. Stay safe.